Hello there, Vicky. My name is Leo. Uh, we we sent an email the other day and you replied. Um, and I'm going to talk to you about a couple of things here uh, which can help you in your business um, regarding the website, about generating more business and so forth. I'm going to try to keep this video for you as short as possible. Uh, I'm going to try to keep it under 15 minutes, but it's going to be worthwhile because it's going to show you a lot of things that you can do and some proof. Okay, first of all, looking at your website, it's, I think it's beautiful, I love it. I also am a very big fan of Vietnamese foods, one of my favorite cuisines, anyway, I thought I'd share that with you. Okay, now, you mentioned that you said that you were surprised when I told you that your website isn't mobile friendly. Okay, um, well the thing is, yeah, you can, you can view it on a mobile, but that's not what mobile friendly means. I'll show you what that means right now. Okay, now, if somebody's searching on their mobile, will squeeze a page down. You can view it, but all these words don't fit in. You have to do this, um, and this doesn't fit in. And usually, when that happens, people get a little bit annoyed. It's a little bit difficult to read the website. Therefore, they might get fed up and just go to another website. Okay, now I'll show you who we are. We're in, we're in Sydney. We're in Kellyville. We're local, uh, so we're not in India or China. We're just up the road from you. Um, this is our business here, this is who we are, um, that's me there, the happy guy, and I'll show you what I mean by mobile friendly. So, if I'm to squeeze this page, you can see that all the words fit in here perfectly. Everything fits into a mobile. Um, okay, so that's the number one tip. I will show you more proof of that. I use this, uh, I have many tools here. I've put your website in here. Uh, to see if it's mobile friendly. So as you can see on a desktop it works fine um, and that's how it would look on a mobile. If you can see that it doesn't really fit in to a mobile. So that's the information there. Um, okay that's from that site there. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a few things that you could do to generate more business if you wanted to generate more business if you wanted to get the phones ringing and grow your business so what I've done here is I've obviously done my research I've been looking at this industry for a long time and we found my partners and I have discovered that catering is something that we want to go for uh, only because we found some gaps in the market so I've just typed in the number one keyword for catering of course catering Sydney that's what people are searching for Corporate catering, buffet catering, catering Sydney West. These are the search terms. Google's telling me pretty much if somebody's searching for catering, they're also searching for this. So Google's leaving us some clues here. Now, I don't know if you know about this one. These are called Google AdWords. You pay for these. Um, they can work. Well, actually, they do work. They're very tricky and complicated too. Very fiddly as well. But you can make that work. Okay, now, second of all, we've got the Google map listings. So Google it knows where I am, and they're gonna show me uh, the businesses that are nearby to me. So this is called the Google map listing, local. So I live around here, and it's showing me the two closest companies that have registered with Google. Okay, so they're the map listings. We also get people in here as well. And the number one, this is the number one guy here. He's number one everywhere. Uh, flavors catering okay so what I've done here I'm going to show you one of my other tools and I've done some research on on, on these people here and I've also put yours in there uh, in the next one I'll show you okay what does all this mean now this here 1.7 K that's 1700 keywords he's using in his website and he's optimized for Traffic, that means how many people are coming to his website. This guy is massive. As you can see there, it's 3,760 people coming to his website on a monthly basis. This is absolutely massive. Now I'm going to get to the keywords. As you can see, he's opt optimized for the number one, the, the most important keywords, which is catering Sydney. That generates around about 2,400 searches a month. And catering is 3,600. He's got the large market share of this. These are the positions. So wedding catering is number three. Gourmet catering is number one. And so forth.
But look at this, party catering, he's at number six. So I'm seeing opportunities where I could capitalize with another catering company. Um, so it could be ca party catering, that could be perfect for you. Okay, uh, where else are we? Catering companies, he's number five. Uh, food catering Sydney, he's number three. But the, all the other good keywords, he's number one. Okay, so there's a lot of opportunities there. Now I've put yours in here, uh, catering at your place. And unfortunately, Google has only picked you up for two keywords. And traffic, not really much at all. You know, that might not be 100% accurate. You might be getting 20 people to your website and word of mouth, which is good. But I'm just saying that if you wanted to generate more uh, people to your website, this is how it's all done. These are the keywords that you're picked up for, which is your place and yum char at your place. Um, they're obviously in your website, but I don't think that's really going to drive too much uh, traffic uh, to your website there. Okay, so going back over here, I'll put your business name in there, that's fine. And this one here, catering. So what I could suggest you do uh, is to at least get yourself in here for the area that you're in. Uh, I try to find the location that you're in, but I couldn't find that anyway. So this is called Google My Business. You do that by uh, registering and verifying your business with Google, number one. And number two, then you need to do a whole bunch of directory listings, about 100. And what happens is Google will eventually find you and put you in here when people are searching near your area. And there's Flavors Catering again. He's number one everywhere. Okay. In the next thing uh, I'm going to show you is proof. Okay, so I'll go over here and show you some proof of what I've done with some of the uh, businesses that I'm working for. So I'll just open this up here. Okay, I've been working with this guy here for about just a couple of weeks now. Okay, uh, I've been working with him for just a couple of weeks now. Uh, I'm going to show you some proof here. This is a garage store repair guy that I'm working with. He's in the North Shore. Because uh, I'm not in the North Shore, I had to put the North Shore in. But if somebody's searching in the North Shore, they won't put that in, but I'll just show you what's happened here. Um, already, just by verifying his business with Google carefully, I've managed to get myself up in here already. That's not generating a ton of business yet, but it'll slowly get there. Um, I'll open this up to show you that that's my site. And I'm also number three here. Uh, the reason why I've done well is because I, I found an opportunity where people weren't capitalizing on this area in the North Shore too much. So I'm just going to show you, there it is, that's a website there. Um, as you can see, I have click to calls here. It's very easy to get in touch as well, free instant quote. Uh, for your website, you, you know, you could put down contact me right away, so forth. Okay, so that's my website there again. I'm going to show you another one. This is a fencing uh, business I've been working with for the last three, four months. Now, uh, just like catering, the number one keyword is fencing. And I've had to put the North Shore because we're in the North Shore. And uh, that's me there. And so I've got it in the map listing. Uh, number one is all day fencing. Forget the yellow pages. I'm talking about real businesses. And fencing sitting north. That's me there. So I'm just going to show you the proof. That's my website. Click to call. Um, as you can see, there's a lot of words in here. They're all optimized. North Shore Fencing and Gates, Sydney Fencing, um, Pool Fences, Tubular Pool Fences. These are all keywords. So if somebody was to type in Tubular Pool Fences in the North Shore, then my name would come up. Um, and they would be directed to this website. So you can see there's a lot of keywords in here. Uh, all of our websites are beautiful, easy to get in touch with. And the proof here, that's me there, Leo Levitas. And there I am again. So number one in the Google map listing and number three in the organic search. Um, I've had to put the brakes on this website only because it's generating so much business. The fencing guy that I'm working with can't possibly take on any more customers. He's completely, you know, inundated. I'll just show you the proof of that as well. Uh, just bear with me for a little while, Vicky. So I'll just go to my call tracking here. And I'll show you the proof here in as well. Okay, North Shore Fencing, that's me. I'll load up the reporting. 
and show you how many, not visitors, but how many actual telephone calls. Okay, before he started with us, he was nowhere. And I started with him in May and into June. Started to get one phone call every two days. But now we're up to 75 phone calls a month, uh, which is massive for a fencing company. He just can't keep up with the work. Uh, so that's that there. And what else can I show you? Um, well, what I can show you is that there's opportunities for, for catering in Sydney. So I'm just letting you know, if you wanted to, well, number one, uh, you need to make your website mobile friendly. Um, and I'll show you the proof here. This is these aren't my words. Uh, this is a website called Search Engine Land, and it reads here: It's official. Google says more searches now on mobile phones than on desktop. So there's a proof there, and it's so important to have a, a website that's mobile friendly. Uh, number two, when I was saying a lot of words on your website content, as you can see, here, content is king. Um, you need quality content and then all the keywords so that way when people uh, are searching in Google for Vietnamese or Yum Cha catering services, your keywords are in the website and people can find you and Google will also find you as well, which is really important. Now, you know, I can make this video for another 15 minutes, but I won't. I just wanted to get to the basics and just asking you to see if you are interested and wanted to grow your business. Um, then you know you can take some of the tips that I've done, uh, shown you, and you can do them yourself. Or if you you know if you really wanted to grow your business and you're serious and you're an action taker, then you know give me a call, uh, shoot me an email, text me, whatever it is, uh, not a problem. We have a face. We're just up the road from you. Um, and also just letting you know that we are sending this video to another eleven catering companies in Sydney. Um, because they've all shown interest also. Um, but the thing is that I'm only going to be able to work with one. Uh, the reason uh, that I can only work with one is because, it, well, it's going to be impossible for me to work with 12 other catering businesses and expect to get them up here. Uh, this is where you need to be. You need to be super glued to the very top of Google. Um, you know, you can do Yahoo and Bing, but let's face it, Google is where it's at. 80% of searches come from Google. So like I mentioned, we are going to work with one only. Uh, whether it's you or another company, it doesn't really matter to us. Um, and we will work hard to get you around this area here and work very hard to get you in this map listing as well. So there it is, Vicky. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you have any questions at all or you want to discuss it further, please just give me a call. You'll find all my information in the email that I sent you. Okay, Vicky, thank you, and hopefully we'll talk soon. Bye for now.